Amir, you've directed also uh, and of late many movies have been, you know, uh, curbed by the CBFC and uh, most recently Nawazuddin's movie Babu Moshai Bandhuk Bhaz uh, received 48 cuts. So how do you think that uh, curbs the creativity of the filmmaker and as an actor? Well, you know, I've said it before, I really feel that, uh, I mean, I feel that censorship is something that is, I don't know how relevant it is today. And uh, as far as my knowledge goes, the CBFC in any case is not supposed to censor. It's supposed to uh, grade the film, ke, you know, certify ke, kis age group ko ye film hum dikha sakte. So I guess that's how we should proceed. And I think that's what also Mr. Benegal's uh, recommendations are, if I'm not mistaken. So hopefully things will get there. Things will get better. Uh, towards the right for oh yeah. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know, not many directors get a chance to direct a superstar in their first film. And since you have got Amir in the film, how does it feel that a superstar in your first directorial, debut directorial? Yeah, actually, I'm blessed at many levels. One, that I got to work at Amir Khan Productions on such films like uh, Tare Zameepan and Dhobi Khan. That I got to uh, work with Amir sir as his manager. So actually, I've been blessed at so many levels that when I created him and uh, he liked it, that itself was unbelievable for me. Uh, and then that he went on and, uh, you know, acted in it as well. Frankly, right now, I'm not really believing it. I feel like I'm in a dream right now. So I'm actually blessed. I don't know what else to say. Amir sir, Amir sir, Russell to your right. Oh, Over here. Uh, Amir sir, yeah. Russell to your right. Russell oh, to, okay. Yeah. Okay, so last question, guys. Yeah. Uh, Russell, uh, yeah. Okay, uh, so uh, our, off uh, late, you and Salman sir have been dominating the box office and been giving the highest grossers and have set the bar really high. But suddenly a Tollywood film came, Bahubali, and has blown away all expectations. For the Hindi version alone, it has grossed more than 500 crores. So what is the industry feeling at this point? Or does the industry have more onus on them or are they feeling the pressure? Well, personally, I think it's great. I think that, you know, this is what cinema is all about. Uh, Bahubali has shown us uh, that, you know, language is not a barrier. And as long as people connect with the material, they connect with the story, they connect with the character, <coughs> that's what's important. Uh, so I'm really happy for the film, and I, I have not seen it, unfortunately, as yet. But I look forward to seeing it. And I think it's great. I think, you know, we should make films that people, it's so wonderful that people have connected so deeply with the film and, and gone out there to see the film. And, you know, it, it actually, <laughs> that film has shown us the potential of Hindi films, which we have not yet, uh, which we have not yet gone to that. So it's really wonderful. I think it's great and, and all congratulations, uh, all congratulations to the entire team for the huge success that they've had. Yeah, I'm really happy about it. Thank you so much. Thank, thank you so much guys. Thank you. Thank you. I just want to say one thing. I just want to say one thing before I leave. So Advait was saying how fortunate he feels he is. Actually, I want to say that Kiran and I feel we are so fortunate that such talented people have come to us with material that we have loved. And it is, uh, you know, it is great for us to be able to uh, make films uh, and produce films, give opportunities to creative talent like Adwait. And I, I think that, you know, Secret Superstar is a title. In the film, it refers to Zaira. And of course, Zaira is a huge star. And uh, she's no longer secret. <laughs> she was until the it released. But I must tell you that Secret Superstar has got many Secret Superstars in it. And slowly, one by one, we will be revealing each of the Secret Superstars to you as we go along this journey. And Adwet is certainly one of them. When you see the film, you will realize what a beautiful story he has written and how well he has made the film. 